Hi, it's Tessa, and I'm here today with my March favorites, and before I get into that, I just wanted to say that I just left the hair salon, and I got a long angled bob, so it's long in the front, and then I'll turn around so you can see the back. Hopefully I'm in shot here. Can you see the back? It's really short in the back. So I got like, I think like eight inches cut off the back, and I think I'm still in shock. Um... I'm not sure how I feel about it yet. I'm going to have to work with it for a few days and see what I think of it, but I don't know. We'll see. I'll probably miss my long hair, but at least it's longer in the front, so I don't feel like it's too, too short like it would be if I got a regular bob. All right, so for my March favorites, the first thing I have is this lavender and vanilla pillow mist from Bath & Body Works. This is from the Sleep Line, the Aromatherapy Sleep Line. I love this stuff. I spray it every night on my pillow, and it's fantastic. really helps you relax, and it's great. Next, I have the Fortune Cookie Soap Whipped Cream in the Loop Lotion. This smells just like Fruit Loops, and I love it. I also got this soap, too, but mm, I could just smell that all day. <laughs> it smells like cereal. Then I got, uh, let's see what I have here, the Pink More Love Body Mist. This is just a fun spring scent. It's kind of floral, kind of fruity. Good combination. Really like that. And um, the Pacifica Indian Coconut Nectar Perfume, which I love wearing. It's one of my favorites. I have that in a rollerball also. I actually have two rollerballs. Then I ordered from Vitacost the Coconut and Papaya Soap with Vanilla Bean. This smells so good and it lathers so nice and it's a big bar it is five ounces so love that then for makeup i only have a couple things um the first one is what i'm wearing on my lips today and that's the bare minerals moxie in get ready which i got in my ipsy bag i love this color it's just the perfect pinky I don't know. It's just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Love that. And this is the first Bare Minerals lip gloss or lipstick I ever used. And it is just so pretty. And I can't quit looking at my hair because I think I'm a little bit traumatized. Let me tuck this behind my ear so it's not falling in my face. Then I have the Revlon Color Stay makeup in the color is 200 Nude. This is my everyday foundation. I wear this constantly. The Chapstick in Great to Meet You, which I found at Walmart. I really like this. It's a switch up from strawberry or cherry. Fun. Um, my CoverGirl Clump Crusher Mascara. I bought a new tube, so I'm back to loving it. My other one, I think, was just so dried out. It wasn't um, working right anymore. Then I have the Jordana 12-Hour Made to Last Liquid Eyeliner Pencil in Black Point which stays all day. It doesn't smudge. I really, really like this. And it's really soft and it's really, really black. And I think they're like $2.99 at Walgreens. Can't beat the price. I have two makeup brushes by Emily Makeup Brush and I got them on eBay. The numbers are comparable to MAC. It's a 239 and a 217 um, dupe. I really like these. I used this one this morning. This is the 217. That's why it's dirty. And it looks like that. And then this one's the 239, which is flatter. Um, this is a great crease brush, and so is this. So I love these for crease work. And my friend Deanna, I was using the 239. She said to pull out the 217, and I really, really like it. The last three things I have are nail polish. Um, Essie Bikini Sotini. Just a really pretty periwinkle blue. It has shimmer in the bottle, but you cannot see the shimmer when you have it on. Uh, this color, Pacific Blue by Sally Hansen. Everybody loves this color. When I wear it, I get so many compliments. Like, what is the color? So it's this bright cobalt nail polish. And the last one is Zoya Yana. And it's just a pink color. It's really, it's really pink, but it's like a deep pink. It's really pretty. And on my nails today, I have Orly O Cabana Boy, if you're wondering what's on my nails. And the last thing is a clothing item. It is the 
Victoria's Secret Daily Tunic, which I think they have renamed. It's still a tunic, though. But um, it's just this big tunic, and it's like narrower at the bottom and really wide at the top, and it's can be worn in so many different ways, off the shoulder, um, on the shoulder, off both shoulders. I just love it. It's so comfortable, and I really, really like that. So thanks for watching, and it's going to take me till next month to get used to this haircut. So let me know what you think of it, because I'm not even sure what I think of it. All right, thanks for watching, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.